Lilies, I'm going to show you how to make a really fabulous vase with some supermarket lilies, a simple vase from the cupboard and some fruit. So get your really lovely glass vase from the cupboard and fill it with any fruit you like. I filled it with some lovely red apples, but you can fill it with some lemons or limes or oranges. Have some fun with it. Uh, and I've got them all the way around the edge and we've left a kind of void in the middle so you can get your stems in. So without further ado, I'm going to start. This is a really lovely stargazer lily, slightly scented and lovely and open. So I've removed the lower leaves and we're going to get a nice snip up and again snip up the stem and then just add them into the void in the middle. So keep doing that. And with the open ones, it's best to remove the pollen so you don't get it on your clothes. And um, I think I've told you this before, but if you do get it on your clothes, simply get a piece of sellotape and give it a good old dab, then it's gone. And then you don't have to go to the dry cleaner. So we're adding these very lovely lilies. I'm adding three. You don't want any of the foliage under the water. Um, and what I am going to do with these lovely laurel leaves behind, I'm going to make a little bit of a decoration around the top, a bit like you're coming out of a laurel crown. So we're popping these in here and you can use any leaves you like. I'm using these laurel ones from Lucy's Laurel Bush. We're actually in Lucy's garden, um, which is lovely, lovely to be here. So we're popping those around and it just gives it a little bit of a, a fun touch. I'm hoping my hair doesn't blow off. So we've popped those around there just to give it a kind of a, a smart collar. Anyway, then we're going to carry on adding our lilies. So these lilies, oh my goodness, I wish you could smell them. They smell absolutely divine. And it's quite nice for a buffet table at a party or maybe um, on a hall as you come in, to greet the guests. Again, snipping up the stem. And these you could get from your corner shop, a garage. They're very simple, lovely lilies, probably grown in Holland. And this is what we call conditioning, removing the lower leaves and giving them a snip. So what we're doing here is just, it's just a simple decoration that you can have for any occasion. And as I said, um, you could use oranges with some orange lilies or some nice zesty green apples with um, some white lilies for a nice smart green and white look. So what you want to do is get them going into a little bit of a splay because they'll all open um, and look gorgeous for your party. And this is the sort of thing your guests will arrive and think, ooh, that's a bit of a fun thing. So adding them nicely. I'm making this into a bit of a front facer, so this would go against a wall. Nearly there. It's so simple, this sort of thing, and it's just sort of fun, rather than just, you know, supermarket flowers in a vase. So we're nearly there, one more to go. And then, if you want to give it a kind of a really professional look, you can add some leaves as a collar, another collar. And uh, these are from um, a Swiss cheese plant that Lucy did have in her house, but she doesn't anymore. So if you're bored with a, with a house plant, you can just chop it up or um, get these from your florist. These are called Monstera leaves. There's a lot of shuffling to be done. So this just gives it a, another kind of a level of high-endness, if there's such a phrase. So one more for luck. Again, snipping the stems so they, they um, drink nicely with the water. It's, it's all in the tweak, as I say. Anyway, that's your lily vase with the fruit. Enjoy your flowers. For more fabulous flowery films, simply subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking here.